Welcome to Elevate Health, the accredited online academy for health professionals. My name is Davy, and I will guide you through this course tutorial. You're now in the first learning activity of an Elevate course. All courses start with introductions. Your fellow participants, your lecturer, and your e-moderator introduce themselves. A great way to get to know each other. When you've finished a learning activity, you just click on Complete to go to the next activity. Let me introduce you to our e-moderators. The e-moderators are your tutors. They will be online every day of the course to guide you in your learning process. Now, click on Course Overview to go to the Overview section of this tutorial. You're now in the Overview section. As you can see, Elevate offers different kinds of learning activities, like To Do and To Discuss, To Watch and To Test. Click on the second learning activity to experience how you can interact with fellow participants. One of the methods we use to stimulate interaction between participants is the use of statements. As you can see, Adam posted the following statement. E-learning is the future of education. Do you agree? Thank you for your vote. Now click on Complete. To do Another way of interacting can take place in an assignment based on an article as you see here. You and your fellow participants will discuss your questions and answers about the article in a discussion forum. Click on Complete to experience the use of web lectures in Elevate's courses. Hi and welcome. I'm Ria. In this short web lecture, I'll explain the use of web lectures in Elevate's courses to you. Most of our courses consist of several short web lectures of around 20 minutes each. Each of these are supported by slides, just as you can see here. Every few minutes, a question about the content of the lecture will be presented to you. This really helps your learning outcomes and it will also help to keep you focused. Now please answer the first question of this web lecture. You will receive immediate feedback on your answer. You've just finished your first web lecture. Now, click on Continue to go on to the last. Personalized feedback is also an important factor within the e-modules. These modules offer content interspersed with different kinds of questions. When you answer a question, you will receive immediate feedback. Please click on Enter to enter the e-module. This drag and drop question is an example of the different kinds of questions an e-module can offer. Please answer the question and then click on Submit. This Pick Many question is another example of a possible e-module question. Please answer the question and then click on Submit. And finally, classic true or false questions are offered in our e-modules as well. Please answer the question, well done, you finished all the questions of the e-module. Please keep in mind that this is just a small selection of the many types of questions we offer in our modules. Now, click on Continue to exit the e-module and finish this tutorial. You are back in the Overview section and you've reached the end of this tutorial. We hope you've enjoyed it and we'd love to see you soon in one of our courses.